Are you interested in becoming a hacker? Do you want to know more about hacking? In this video, we will be talking about how to become a hacker. Before we continue, please subscribe to our YouTube channel by hitting the subscribe button below to get a notification on our next video. A computer hacker is a computer specialist who employs non-standard methods to accomplish a goal or overcome an impediment within a computerized system. The term hacker has come to be associated with a security hacker someone who uses their technical knowledge of bugs or exploits to break into computer systems and access data. They are various reasons one can become a hacker. Firstly the hacking industry is thriving. Driving. This is relevant to both white hat and black hat hacker job markets. The danger landscape is growing increasingly hostile, with businesses becoming unwitting participants. Cyber criminals are growing more sophisticated and aggressive in their attacks on systems. Companies are unable to defend themselves effectively, and as the business environment gets increasingly computerized, these tendencies are only expected to worsen. Secondly, you may consider being a hacker, so you think and act like a malicious hacker to protect your business. You can understand the mind of a nasty hacker by learning how cyber criminals think and work. Learning their procedures and approaches, as well as becoming familiar with their rationale, allows you to stay one step ahead of them. Thirdly, being a hacker will help you successfully defend yourself against attacks. As an information security specialist, the CEH certification allows you to have complete control and insight over your organization's systems, and this allows you to effectively defend and safeguard against data breaches. Computer hackers gain access to computers to steal, alter, or delete data, generally by installing malicious software without your knowledge or consent. Their devious strategies and in-depth technological understanding enable them to gain access to confidential information. The average monthly payment for a hacker in the United States is $6,199 as of July 15, 2021. The highest paid hacker in the U.S. is Kevin Mitnick with an estimated net worth of $25 million. Kevin David Mitnick was born on August 6, 1963, is a convicted hacker, computer security expert, and author. He is primarily known for his high-profile 1995 arrest and subsequent five-year sentence for computer and communications-related crimes. There are various steps one must take to become a hacker, and below are step-by-step -step guides on how to become a hacker. Number 1. Read the Hacker Handbook. Being a hacker is a demanding task. As a hacker, you must have a positive attitude and be curious. The Hacking Manifesto can educate you on how to think like a hacker. It's more important to build competency in the languages than it is to have a stereotypical mindset when it comes to cultivating the hacker attitude. Although many people believe that a hacker is a criminal, they are now engaged by large corporations to protect information and minimize potential damage. Hacking is essentially the act of being an overly curious and outwitting authority. You should be hellbent on breaking authoritarian norms, secrecy, and censorship if you're a hacker. Another weapon that will be used is deception. Number 2. Learn to program in C. C programming is one of the most powerful programming languages available and it is essential to truly grasp it. C programming will essentially assist you in breaking down the task into smaller chunks that may be expressed using a series of commands. Try developing your program and analyzing the reasoning. To learn C programming, there are hundreds of free PDFs and tutorials available on the internet. Number 3. Learn different programming languages. It is critical to master other modern computer programming languages such as Java, Perl, PHP, and Python if you want to become a hacker. Reading books written by specialists is one of the finest ways to learn these things. Knowing markup languages like XML and HTML, as well as data formats like JSON, Protobuf, and others, which are standard ways to move data between client and server, can be beneficial. Number 4. Learn how to use Unix. Unix is a multitasking, multi-user computer operating system that is designed to keep computers secure. The easiest method to learn is to start with an open source version such as CentOS and install and operate it on your own. You can use the internet without knowing Unix, but you won't be able to be a system administrator. Number 5. Learn different operating systems. Apart from Unix, there are other additional operating systems. Because the Windows operating system is one of the most regularly compromised systems, it is beneficial to learn how to hack Microsoft closed-source systems. Number 6. Learn Network Concept. When you want to be a hacker, your networking notion must be razor-sharp. Understanding how networks are built is critical, 
but you also need to understand the variations between different types of networks. To be able to exploit vulnerabilities on the internet, you must have a thorough understanding of the TCP IP and UDP protocols. Number 7. Study Cryptography. You must comprehend and master the art of cryptography to be a skilled hacker. Cryptography and encryption technology are critical for the internet and networking. It is the practice and study of ways for safe communication while third parties are present. Encryption is used for a variety of reasons in information security, including data confidentiality. Number 8. Experiment a lot. This is a crucial step in establishing yourself as a skilled hacker. Create your laboratory to test what you've learned in the classroom with real-world applications. The most basic lab will have your computer, but as you go, you may wish to add other computers and required hardware for your research. Number 9. Learn from experts. Reading will always help you learn more. Read as many books and articles written by specialists in the field of ethical hacking and enterprise security as you can. In the world of hackers, reading a lot about everything related is so vital that you should also think about improving your reading speed. Number 10. Take part in hacking competitions. Participating in hacking challenges regularly can help you learn more and improve your skills. Several firms host these challenges to assess the security of their software solutions. Breaching the security mechanism of software and gaining control of third-party computer systems are the most typical hacking challenges. Aside from that, there are a few websites listed below that give online hacking tasks regularly. Number 11. Write vulnerabilities. The vulnerability of software is the program's weakness. Looking out for a weakness in an existing application and sharing it with others is a solid strategy. In this manner, you'll be able to get a variety of viewpoints from various sources, allowing you to improve your present skill set. You can also contribute to security open source projects. Contributing to an open source computer security project is an excellent way to put your abilities to the test. This may not be to everyone's taste. These types of open source projects are available from a variety of organizations, including Mozilla and Apache. Make an effort to participate in these projects and make a useful contribution to the community's benefit. Most people who give it their all can develop a solid skill set in 18 months to 2 years if they focus totally on it. Hacking, on the other hand, is a gigantic ocean whose mysteries will take years to unravel. And, if you're a true hacker, you'll spend the rest of your life honing your skills and your art. A bachelor's degree in information technology or an advanced qualification in network security is required of an ethical hacker. He or she must have substantial network security experience, as well as functional knowledge of numerous operating systems. Hope this video was helpful? Thanks for watching this video. Please share your opinions in the comments section below, and remember to click the subscribe button to be the first person to watch new videos on this channel.